What's up, everybody? How y'all doing? Uh, this is Shadow, and we are going to be looking at the leaderboards for this current arena. We've got round one of the Absorbing Man and Jabari Panther arena. Jabari Panther was the featured, and uh, Absorbing Man was in the basic. And between the two, Absorbing Man is definitely the more hype of the two. If you don't have an Absorbing Man, you want an Absorbing Man. He is great all around. He's good in Battlegrounds. If you're into that game mode, he's good on defense and on offense. Jabari Panther is okay, but you don't really see a lot of people using her. She's, she's, I think mine, did I take mine up? I think mine is still rank one. Okay, so that should let you know. All right, let's take a look here. Um, I already finished up. I hate when this happens because there's an arena wins on, but I'm already done with the arenas. And I don't feel like doing more arena just for that one. I'd rather take a break. And me and my sister Stiletto are going to be watching some anime right after I make this video. All right, so um, I think there's this... <clears throat> a new one on, on Netflix uh, that she wants to uh, watch. All right, let's check out the leaderboards here. And we'll start, even though it's the most hyped one, we're going to start with the Absorbing Man one because we usually start with the basic and then we end with the uh, featured. Now, I'm going to look for some names because anybody that doesn't already have him, and I know a lot of people wanted him really badly, myself included, from the uh, featured, when he was in the featured, we wanted him. Well, I got him, ranked him up to four. Uh, people want to know if he is um, good unawakened or does he need to be awakened? He's good unawakened, but you want him awakened. It really helps him out. You want him SIG 200. It really helps him out. And it'll make him more fun to play. Okay? So definitely, if you can awaken him, awaken him. And put as many six stones as you can into him. Mine is awakened. And I'm trying to remember. I don't think he's SIG 200 yet. But he's up there. Um, I, I'm working on that. And it also helps him out even on uh, defense, if I remember correctly. Um, it it lets, uh, makes his forms last longer. Uh, so, yeah, you want him at SIG 200. Mad Max. Hmm. Hope I didn't miss anybody. Uh, so, ooh, El Shaddai. I haven't seen that name in a while. Okay. I remember that song from um, Amy Grant. El Shaddai. El Shaddai, El Kankana Adonai, age to age we're still the same, by the power in your name. Oh yeah, but I hadn't seen him in a while, because every time I saw his name, I thought of that song. Um, But if you guys would, Leave a comment and let me know what score you put up and what you got, because I'm going to adjust my cutoff predictions. I had no idea. Um, my guess was around 40 million. However, for first round, I always put up a much higher prediction because I do not want anybody aiming for my prediction, missing and being mad at me. Even though you tell people, these are guesses. We don't really know. People still going to get mad. And so I usually try to guess very high. I, I basically put down what I would do. So if I were going for uh, Absorbing Man round one in the basic, I'd be up there at like 60, 70 million. Guaranteed. That's just That's just me. But I expect he won't go that high. So leave a comment. This is only round one. And a lot of people are probably waiting for round two. Some people don't have that kind of time. And they're working during uh, round two. So they go for round one. But it does help. It helps out a lot of people 
uh, to know what to aim for round two. All right. Not really seeing a, a lot of names. I think a lot of people already have him or they're just waiting for round uh, two. Or I missed some names, which happens. Been happening often. I don't like it. I just be up Jack Nasty. All righty then. Um, let's see, Mummy. I know that name. Healthy and happy. I like that. Positive. Yes. All right. Um, let's see, Sadar. Okay. Uh, so definitely leave a comment and let me know what score you put up. Let's look at Jabari. Now, some folks may go, oh, shasha boom, an angry elephant. Look at this. All these names that are usually there, Pepecto. These guys, I don't really know personally, but they're often in the uh, leaderboards. Chosen, 34. Congratulations. Um, but we all know she going low. So I definitely am curious as to what she went for. Um, I would not be surprised if she went for like around 60 for the six star. Would not be surprised at all. So definitely um, let me know in the uh, comments. Uh, let's see. Vincent K. Remind me of Vincent Price. Y'all remember that? J4 is awesome. Congratulations. Everything is awesome. Everything is cool when you're part of a team. All right. Uh, let's see. Ark Nephilim. Uh, do, 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 do. Dangerous and bad. Okay. <laughs> American Jedi. Not American Ninja. American Jedi. Do y'all remember, um, what was it, Star Wars, the uh, MMO? I don't know if it's even still up. Solid Snake, congratulations. What? I don't often see your name. Um, but I remember I, I tried playing that a little bit when it was uh, still in beta. It was, it was about to be released. And I remember, I'm like, okay, so you made a game where you know everybody is going to want to be a Jedi. And you made it so that you cannot choose to be a Jedi. And that I think in the beginning or in beta, you had a chance and it was a completely out of your control whether you became a Jedi or not. And I can understand the logic in that because if they allowed that, most people would be Jedis. And so they were trying to Mix it up, knowing that that would be the most popular choice. People didn't like that. They were like, hey, we play these games so that we can pretend that we are our favorite characters. And the favorite characters of a lot of people are the Jedis. You know, Yoda. You know, Luke Skywalker. Darth Vader. Darth Maul. I mean, come on. You know? Um, but... I forget what they, they did afterwards. They did try to make a change, but I don't think it really worked. Um, <laughs> I'm beast. <laughs> okay. Good to have that uh, positive esteem. Good, good, good self-esteem. Okay. Uh, Z Fighters. Okay. Um, but yeah, that, if I remember right, it, it ended up being a flop. It was just really bad. They they scrambled. They tried to do. And it was a shame because there were a lot of good things about that game. Maybe they turned it around. I don't know. This was years, years ago. And I, I kind of was like, oh, wait, you can't do what? <laughs> you can't do this? You can't do that? Okay, never mind. And I said, I'll just wait for other people to talk about it. And I went back to whatever MMO I was playing at the time. I, I tended to be a one game. Very monogamous gamer. One game, main game at a time. And 
when I looked at that game, I was looking at it for the potential that I was going to switch from my main game to start playing that game. And I was like, yeah, no, this don't have what it takes. Anyway, that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Remember to leave a comment, like the video if you like it. If you don't like it, leave a dislike. But if you leave a dislike, leave a comment. Let me know why you uh, disliked it. Maybe it's something that I can do to fix it. Maybe it's just something that it's just going to be. And you just not going to like them. Okay? But anyway, take care. And you all have a blessed day. Thank you.